In this video, I'm going to show you how to see your Apple ID password on your iPhone. Now, there's a few different areas where you could have your Apple ID password saved, and we're going to check those first, and then if that doesn't work, we're going to show you how you can change your password. So first, let's go into your settings, and then we're going to scroll down to the passwords option. Click on passwords, and then when you log in, you're going to be given your saved passwords where you can search at the top search bar for Apple. And then if you have it saved on your device, it'll show up here. I don't have mine saved, so you can't see it. So I'm going to show you another option of where you can find it. And that's using the Google password manager. So I'm going to search and open up a Google application. For this, I have Chrome on my device. So I'm going to open up the Chrome browser. And then I'm going to make sure I'm logged in to my account to where I have a saved password for my Apple ID. So here I'm going to click on my icon in the top right. And then I'm going to click on Passwords Manager. And then once it logs me in, it'll show me all of my saved passwords. You can scroll through and find your Apple saved password, your Apple ID and your password. Or you can search it in the top for Apple. And then your saved password should show up there and you should be able to see your email, your Apple ID and your password. And if you can't find your saved password there, we're going to go ahead and request a change to your Apple ID password. So we're going to go back to your settings and then we're going to click on your Apple ID. So your name and icon at the very top there, we're going to click on that. And then we're going to click on sign in and security, that second option there. And then once we're in here, there's that option to change password. Go ahead and click change password. And then once you're in, you can type in your new password and you can verify. This will change your Apple ID password. And then, and then I recommend saving that password somewhere else so you don't forget it. So that's how you can find your Apple ID password through multiple areas or change your password if you weren't able to save it and you can't find it. Thanks for tuning in. Hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe.